It's for any of your ideas off script. Yep. Give me your thoughts on stage one, finale. It's uh, actually, I would say, tougher than expected. It's a tricky little running, really tough first kilometer, steep kind of plateaus, and uh, just a drag strip to the finish line, two, three percent, so tough first day. What do you reckon to that climb, NG? Yeah, solid. It's, uh... Well, yeah, solid. Maybe. This isn't your finest interview, G. <laughs> He knows nothing about football, but France on the back. France and who? Czech. Yeah. Czech. Oh, okay. <laughs> one good one, one not so good 400 one. 400 euros for the winner, though. Yeah. Dylan, who'd you get? Uh, money. Italy and England. Okay, that's probably the strongest. Even, I didn't even took one out. Okay. They, they did it for me. <laughs> I, Too I busy on the boat. Who did you get? Austria and Sweden. Oh, yeah, no uh, chance. Poland lost against Sweden last night. Oh, Billy! Right then, I've got to go now. I've got to go see my fans. Mr. Big Time by your luck. Again, again, again. again. It's for any of your ideas off script. Yep. Got it. <laughs> Are you happy now? Man, you show me your smile. Show me your smile. Ha <laughs> ha. Marco, George, where are we? What's happening? France, <laughs> stage one. Exciting. More information, the better, no? Tour de France number what then, Luke? Number seven. First Tour de France, how are you feeling now? Wait. Down or? Uh, down, ready. Yeah, down. Uh, I don't know. Excited, but still. Feels like normal racing, to be honest. So everything's pretty similar. That's the whole point that you race all your career for a big event that feels normal, no? I think. Practice or something like that. So yeah, we'll see. Looking forward to getting stuck in. That was pretty crazy out there. Yeah, it was a solid day. It was stressful, a few crashes. Obviously, a big crash at the end. I had no idea who was in it. Gutted about Richie and Taylor both. I think they both crashed or at least held up. So. I don't know how far behind if they lost time or what, but Billy was good, so yeah. You say the biggest crash you've ever seen? No, maybe not, but it's a big, big crash. Okay, hope every, everybody's uh, good, no? Yeah, pretty much. Got a last one, boys. Good job, man. <laughs> is he watching the football or has he turned it off in disgust? Uh, I think he just yeah, switched it off. He doesn't want to watch. No, I'm still believing. 20 minutes. 2 0 down, you know, a bit Joe Allen, Ramsey, Bale, Magic, and then you never know. Garen Thomas is uh, caught in the crash. Uh, from uh, Jumbo Visma. Uh, Hesink in the crash. Tony Martin in the crash. Garen Thomas is uh, still on the ground.
Oh, you're looking pretty beat up. G, how are you feeling? We had a bit of rain, hit a speed bump, lost my pants on the bars. It's down before I know, knew it, really. Yeah, so the race doctor put it back in and um, it's like instant relief then. When it was all stressful and fighting for position and stuff, I didn't want to get too involved in that. Just sat further back and then luckily enough, when all those crashes started happening at the end, then was had time to avoid them. So, um, but yeah, mad day, really. Yeah, I think just, I oh, just take it each day as it comes now, really. Like, I think um, I have a few painful days in store. Like, obviously, the day you crash, you kind of just, it's a bit of adrenaline and everything, isn't it? But next couple of days, for sure, shoulder and things, hip, be sore, but, um, yeah, see how I go. You yeah, always know the tour is a difficult race, and this one is uh, not different. You know, so with the rain, with the showers, and I think uh, it's a small downhill. And with the sprint, uh, everyone wants uh, to be in the front, and finally it's too much. Whoa! Wow.